Now we have three and out. All right. I'm actually quite proud of this week's three and out, okay? I, mm. I've i just perused the questions. Okay. I could be going over my head here, and I'm hoping I'm not ruining it by talking about it. But your first question for three and out tonight, since we've been talking a, quite a bit about football, is this. Do you think you could throw a football further than a 1940s Heisman Trophy winner? Nope. Now, how far – let's see, I don't know what the average – distance a 1940s college quarterback could throw a football so i think we should start by getting the average uh yardage that we can throw a football and i know mine because i hosted a punt pass kick competition several years ago so i know how far i could throw a football wes how far do you think you can chuck one downfield mm, i mean maybe like a touch over 40 yards hmm Okay, touch over 40. Alan, what you got? Yeah, I was going to say, I'm probably right around like 40 yards. I might even okay. I might even be honest and say like 35, 40. Yeah. Okay, and I know I'm between 35 and 40 yards. So, yeah, yeah. So we'll say 37, 37, 42. So yeah. we'll say we'll just put it an average of 40 yards. So could a Heisman Trophy winner throw a 40-yard pass back in the 1940s? Yeah, I think so. Pretty sure. Yeah, I think even uh I mean a Heisman Trophy winner in the forties was an NFL star probably in the fifties and sixties. So you're talking yeah, yeah, absolutely. I think I, I should. think I think yeah. with those guys, uh while the uh game was heavily predicated and heavily dictated on the run, yeah. I still think it during some practice times and certain during some show off sessions, uh those guys could fucking uncork one yeah. uh, f- further than we could throw it. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So uh, just a country mule could throw a rock a country mile, bottom line. <laughs> yeah, what. basically. That's, that, I think so. Yeah. That's because I, my my, uh, my co-host at the time, he threw the football 72 yards. Jesus He was Christ. like six foot four, 240 yeah, pounds. That's what I'm saying. Just a big man of meat muscle. It was just... It was just it made you feel like less of a man. It felt like you could feel <laughs> testosterone draining from your body <laughs> as you saw this ball just hover in the air for what seemed like five minutes until it touched the ground. Forever. Yeah. Forever, forever, ever. Forever, ever. Yeah. I've, I think I t- I've seen – I know you're talking about your old co-host down in, down in uh, Georgetown. Yeah. Yeah. And that, uh, now, was he – did he have any uh, experience in? in was, did he did he play some, some he, QB? As obnoxious as he could be, he was one of those guys that was good at any athletic event you could place in front of him. I watched him on a par four hit the green with the driver. It, it was yes. just it, it it just pissed you off. It just pissed you off watching this guy yeah. accomplish Dave? feats of just masculinity. You've met Dave mm-hmm. Greeby. Mm-hmm. He was he's that guy in like that I know. He was just good at pretty much everything. He's a scratch golfer, right. but still. Like he probably was the silkiest smooth fucking white dude on a basketball ball court I've ever seen. Okay. Like sweet jump shot, like good handles. Yeah. He was uh fucking you couldn't strike him out, fucking bas- or baseball player. Like, yeah, it was just fucking solid, slick, all the way across the board. <clears throat> like, it's crazy. So to answer your question, now I don't think we're. Uh, I think even the uh, even the guys in the forties were. Uh, yeah, I think they're hucking hucking bombs. Unless it was a defensive end <laughs> who won a Heisman. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Well, see, but see, then that's the other question. Though, that, speaking of the guy, my ex co-host, like. So he could throw it 70 yards. So he could probably throw it further than the guy from the 1940s, right? Sure. Maybe he's got the wrong collection of idiots uh, answering this question. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Christ, All I right. think yeah. – I, I, yeah, I, I, yes, definitely. 72 yards, that's most than that's, – that's, that's more than most people on earth. Yeah. yeah. No, it's probably further than some NFL quarterbacks at yeah. that. Yeah. It's a bomb. All right, question number two. Who would win in a fight? Allen Iverson – or Yao Ming. Mm, I got Iverson. You got AI? Yeah. Virginia Beach kid. Pow, 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 pow. Just body and Yao. Like, fuck it. it like, <laughs> even if he doesn't, even, even if he doesn't knock him out, Yao's liver gives out. 
<laughs> from body shots. <laughs> just pow, 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 pow. And then in between, like, the liver shots, he gives, like, a foot stomp. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> just one. Like, Ugh, stay still. Pow, 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 pow. <laughs> <laughs> no, man. I mean, that, that, that guy was, like, twice his fucking size, twice his weight. No, maybe he grab was only it. twice his weight because he was like eighteen feet tall. <laughs> Bones are heavy. <laughs> yeah, <it's, laughs> yeah. Yao Ming picks him up and throws him. No, he doesn't. He's not that strong. <laughs> what do you mean he was not okay. that strong? What do you Yao mean? Ming was seven foot six, three hundred and eleven pounds. Yeah, yeah, of fucking pure bone. Dude, guy, <laughs> he was 285 pounds of bone. Like I used to body up against centers, Shaq, those guys. He wasn't getting chucked around the cor- court. He's by the fucking injuries. giant. Yeah, that's that's my point. Oh, Little no. six foot, five foot eleven, nope. 160 pound Iverson. He's kicking shins out. <laughs> fucking sweet shin this music. Is, this is little guy fucking syndrome here, I guess. But yeah, I'm blowing your knee out, then I'm fucking you up. Sweet <laughs> shit, sweet shin music from yeah. d- Dude Love. 100. percent Now. Yeah. See, I'm, bl- I'm blowing your fucking kneecaps out, then I'm fucking you up. <laughs> That's it. I I do think it is a it's a fair question because if it was like Allen Iverson versus Shaquille O'Neal, like someone of comparable yeah, size, no, no. I don't think Allen Iverson stands no, a chance. No shot. There's, there's something about Yao Ming that tells that me I think that it's frail. possible. He's frail. I don't know. Yeah, and, and how fast Allen Iverson yeah, is. Exactly. You know, like there, it's like Spider Man versus the Hulk. Like he's going to get so many shots in. Yes, if if Yao Ming connects, I think it's over. But yeah. if Allen Iverson just keeps up the just heat, keeps moving, and, just keeps fucking moving, I, I think he's I think he's like got enough shimmy and shake, yeah, to make the bake. He just fucking beat his knees in, like bow, 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 bow. <laughs> fucking done. Y'all, y- y'all are foolish. <laughs> Big tree fall hard. Y'all are foolish. <laughs> Chop okay. him down. Well, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna season the pot here for you, there, Wes. Okay. Because I, I years and I'm the reason I'm glad I found this question is because a few years ago, uh, Yao Ming and um, oh shit, uh, Manny Pacquiao, they were <laughs> actually in the airport together, and I remember seeing this, and I'm thinking like, damn, look how teeny tiny Manny Pacquiao is. Now keep in mind, Manny Pacquiao is even smaller than Allen Iverson. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Manny Pacquiao versus Yao Ming. Yeah, what, Manny. What do you day. think there? <laughs> All fucking day. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I, 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 I'd have to. Beating I, up the legs. I mean, if you're putting money on it, I'd, I'd, t- I'd, I'd take Manny. <laughs> simply on the fact that he's a professional fighter. Beating up the legs. Be, but. but God, 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 God. God, I mean, Just, what? In like a. Uh, look, man. You don't chop down redwoods in a day. You just got to <laughs> fucking beat them up. You just beat them up, beat them up, beat them up, beat them up, beat them up. Is that right? Big tree falls. Is that right? That's how it goes, bro. From a guy who is five foot four. That's how it goes. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, sometimes it is not the wise decision sure. to hit a motherfucker in the mouth. See, I, I, I'll, take, I'll take the I'll take, wise decision to hit him in the legs. I'll take Manny. I mean, you can't do that in boxing. Well, I'm not talking about boxing, motherfucker. I'm talking yeah, about fighting. We're, 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 yeah. we're talking about a fight. It doesn't yeah. say in a boxing match. It right. says in like, a fight. So Manny just straight up fucking cold cocks his like, chin. I, like, me and you, you're a very athletic guy. Mm-hmm. You're strong. If I were to fight you, oh, thank you. I will fucking... Uh, my, I'm putting you on the ground. Okay. Because I will win on the ground. Right. That's that's. I mean, so it's... Uh, you're looking at... I mean, I think, especially Manny Pacquiao, right. he's putting that big fucking tree on the ground. At the very least, he's chopping him down to hit him in the mouth. Mm. But, yeah, you got to bring him down to you. Yeah, I'll it take, is what it is. I'll take Manny. I'm not taking that AI. No. <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> not taking wow. Because, I mean, I, I get I get your logic, but I feel like somebody uh, uh, of Allen Iverson's athletic stature and his background, probably been in a fight or two in his life. What's your choice? You know, yeah, he may not have the technical aspects of, like, uh, fighting down, but I'm pretty sure he can scrap, and yeah. he's bigger. Yeah. So I, I, but, but yeah, all right. Okay, I, hold on. I, it, okay, so then, so, so who do you, t- who do you take in a f- fight, AI or Manny? Hmm. Oh, I take Manny. No, okay. All right. Well, because they're even, and Manny's a professional fighter. Oh, so somehow the opponent of Yao Ming at seven five seven six somehow throws the throws the scale into different. What AI AI is better with guys seven foot plus? He's a he went dude. he went he went at him at the basketball Yo, court. He go at him. In the, listen to me. 
tell me you didn't watch Yao Ming play basketball and be like, this motherfucker's knee's going to give out. And that's just him making a cut. Like, if if you give mm. a small guy, I mean, a smart small guy a chance, you're just chopping that down. Sorry. I'll drop kick your knees. I don't care. <laughs> like, I'm, uh, I'm thing, blowing though, out legs. Tall at 16 years old. How many fights have you been in in your life? <laughs> it's also true. Especially growing up in China. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're told that you can't do that. Could you imagine? You just hit him in the fucking nuts once. Fucking he's dead. Mm. <laughs> All right. So the answer to that question is yes. <laughs> One way or the other. Something like that. All right. And finally, I like this question. Do you think you could beat any creature on Earth if you had two samurai swords? Hmm. No, not any no, creature. No, not any. Nope. Okay, name, name. Okay, name the one that takes you down with two samurai oh, swords. What, like fucking cheetahs, pumas, lots of lots of big cats. Yeah, they're fucking me up. Not like tigers or lions. Fuck that. Like, yeah, stealthy fucking cats. They what? fuck me up. I think any 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 real predator of the, uh, of the ocean. Oh, I mean, yeah, and we haven't even gotten into the sea yet. Like, <laughs> are we in the water? We're fucking useless. <laughs> Fuck well, the Why swords. would you go in the water with two samurai? <laughs> I don't fucking know. To, you said the world. To fight a shark. <laughs> yeah. Why wouldn't you? Okay, all right. It's better say, than bear, all right, all right, Let's set up the hypothetical then. Let's say you got some swimmies on. <laughs> and I get my feet bitten off. Great. I'm sure the samurai swords I'm just treading water. All right. All right, fine. You got your scuba gear on, and you got two Still samurai this. swords. Yeah. And there's a shark coming right at you, right? Sure. Are, yeah. Aren't you just doing like a double, like two quick uppercuts as the shark's coming at you? That's like, be- not that pretty much end it? That's because you, it's, it's less gravity. You can't swing the sword as fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You got a jab. Are, you got a these are Quick Tarantino motions. steel, okay? Like these are like just slice through H- anything. Tori like Hanzo butter. swords, okay? Sword. Yeah. yeah, I mean, okay. I, I, I think, get them. I, I think I think a rhino. Uh, well, uh, okay, that's good. That's it. Now, see, that's to me, okay, that's a more applicable okay, animal because okay. I feel like even if a cheetah like dove at me, claws first, as long as I kind of duck dodged and weaved and then threw those swords up then it's over that's you're, that's in game you're fucking out of your mind first of all <laughs> that is that is the most ridiculous thing i've ever heard in my life duck <laughs> duck dodge you duck and, and throw weave. your swords up yeah that fucking cheat is gonna eat the eat your face sir nice. <laughs> but uh no i mean i've always been watching I'm, I'm a big nature guy like i'm a big watch planet earth and fucking that geo and bbc shit uh fucking hippos Hippos are fucking rude, right. and they are mean, and they can run like thirty miles an hour, which is out of, fucking out of control. You have to provoke it. You have to get close to the water. Yeah, when it's to, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, assuming, I assuming, yeah. And I f- almost feel like they, they're so nasty and territorial that they would, they would, uh, they would risk death to fuck you up. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and like, what the fuck are my swords doing? Rhino, that's that's tough leather, bro. Like, that's not happening. That's English leather. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> exactly. You know, you, you, honestly, I think I think I convinced myself all the way up until you said rhino. I do feel like... <laughs> I, could, I do feel like I could, like, dodge the rhino and then, like, start, like, like just, like, I don't know, just like a little rat, like, gnawing at his sides with these two samurais. No way, bro. So Alan Iverson, okay, fair enough. Uh, oh, I got a piss, guys. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying to hold it. I think I'm trying to think if there's anything, anything else that comes to mind. I think platypus. I, mean, I wouldn't want to fuck. Him. I mean, <laughs> if I if I got him on the first jab, I'd be good. But if he fucking bone spurred me, yeah, I I mean that's a deadly poison. I mean, we you think it, about that. Do you think a draft would just stomp the shit out you? Uh, I think it necks you. Like, yeah, it. Whips. It might whack. Yeah, yeah it might whack whips. the piss out of you. Right, yeah, whips the shit out of you. Or an elephant. Ostriches. Ostrich. Ostriches. Yes, are fucking territorial animals. Right. They got very, very large talons. I like my chances with two samurai swords and against they an whip, ostrich. Though. They whip necks. Yeah. Well, yeah, you can you can lop a neck off pretty pretty easily. Like I a think. bull a bull elephant. <laughs> I think, I think my days. Dead man. I think my days are numbered. <laughs> yeah, like, I think you're. <laughs> You 
Chop yeah, suey! Yeah, put a hit! Even with the rhino and As the bull elephant, like, murdered. how fast are they if you see them coming? Mm. Or, uh, I mean, well, let's switch gears here, because... Aren't we like, supposed to fight him? Like a what fucking are we running away? <laughs> nah, like a fucking full grown like bull elk or bull moose. Yeah, yeah, with a fucking rack of antlers, like in the woods. Nah, son, you're done. You're fucking dead. You're I like a dead my, man. I like my chances with two katanas. They're like they're fucking two thousand pound deer with a fucking t- a fucking Toyota on their head. Like it's no. You're dead. Yeah, but see, when I pull that sword out, it makes that sh- Yep. And, that and that's when he fucking murders you. <laughs> <laughs> Just, uh, you guys right have buried you. my dreams, so thank you. <laughs> All, right. All right. I got to pee.